I'll just be real honest. I'm extremely disappointed. Um, I, I am at a loss for words with our ability to shoot the basketball. I thought we, we played extremely scared the first quarter. Um, and you can't do that against good teams. They're, they're way too good. And then every time we got ourselves back in the ball game, we would do something to shoot ourselves in the foot. So we, we have to be better. Uh, especially on the offensive end. We did some good enough things defensively, and we battled on the glass for the most part, but our, our, our offensive execution, the, the first and fourth quarter, stinks, and it's got to get a lot better. It looked like you started to figure some things out over those middle two quarters on offense. Uh, what, what prevented that from clicking in the fourth? <laughs> a lack of toughness. Um, I, I thought we played a little me ball. Um, in the fourth quarter. You know, they do a very good job of helping. They strong side dig. And when you get in there, you got to be able to shot fake and then you got to be able to kick out because they collapse. Um, and I, I thought we took some, some, some four shots there uh, in the fourth quarter. A lot of veteran players from, from both teams. So when you look at Caleb and Franklin on, on their team, what, yep. what types of challenges did they present? Well, Caleb, I mean, she, she's terrific. Uh, I'll be honest, we went from not guarding her to her sophomore year to being unable to guard her junior year. Um, and she's off to a terrific start her senior year. Uh, very, very good. Strong, physical, embraces uh, physicality. She can shoot the three. Um, she can get to the rim. Very, very, very good mid-range dribble jump shot shooter. Um, and, and she likes the challenge. Um, so she's very, very hard to guard. Uh, and then Franklin is just extremely athletic, um, you know, but for the, the most part, Caleb's going to get hers. Um, it, it wasn't our defense. It was our offense. I mean, let's, let's be real honest. And we're not going to win a lot of basketball games when we have three seniors, Nicole, Megan, and Bree, go four for 18. Puts way too much pressure on Carly. Tanya, how, how much? Go ahead. Tanya, when you got it to six there in the third quarter, um, do you still kind of attribute the inability to draw even towards clunky offense, if you will? Or well, we, we, made, we made some bad defensive errors. You know, we, we cut it to six, and um, at the end of the, the third, or we, it was winding down going into the fourth, maybe. Um, we had just cut it, and we leave a shooter. The scouting report it literally says shooter. And we go help for no reason, and they bury it. Got to give them credit. They buried it. Just uncharacteristic um, bad plays at the wrong time. We, we shot ourselves. Every time we got momentum, we, we would shoot ourselves in the foot. And this is where this team has to grow and get better because right now we continue to beat ourselves. And you had 21 turnovers tonight. That's something that you've talked plenty about so far this season. Was there any... Maybe one or two things in particular you saw that, that led to that number being what it was tonight? Well, it, it, it's the scouting report says they love the strong side dig. They're going to help on dribble penetration, and we continue to, to do that. And you, you can't do that against good teams. You certainly can't um, give them points off of turnovers and, and in transition. You have to try to make them play in the half court and limit their transition and their points off of turnovers. And we didn't do a very good job of that tonight. Uh, luckily for us, it's a, it's a quick turnaround and, and we have an opportunity to be a lot better tomorrow. Thanks, Tanya. You bet.